Thank you. Uh, now to this, we are learning new details about a bicyclist who was hit and killed in South LA. Tonight, police releasing this surveillance video of the suspects. The new video comes more than two months since the deadly hit and run. Meantime, we now know the victim's identity. Yeah, let's go right to Chris Wolf. He's live downtown for us. He's got details on this story. Chris. Rick and Cher, typically in these types of situations, authorities are able to find surveillance or security footage of the vehicle involved, but that's all they have to go on at first. However, in this case, investigators tell us they were able to find clear footage of the driver and the passenger, the people inside. Take a good look at this vehicle and the two men who get out when they stop at a gas station in South LA on April 13th close to 3.30 a.m. Los Angeles police say these men are suspected of slamming into and killing 68-year-old Salvador Gonzalez in a hit-and-run crash a little later that morning. It happened on the eastbound side of Adams Boulevard near Trinity Street. Investigators say Gonzalez was riding his bicycle when the SUV rear-ended him. The driver sped off, and after paramedics arrived, they rushed Gonzalez to a local hospital where he died. His daughter Norma shares family photos describing the man nicknamed Chava as a beloved husband, father of two, and grandfather of five, who was adventurous, friendly, outgoing, and basically a kid at heart. She says their family deserves justice. Investigators with the LAPD's Central Traffic Division started looking at local businesses near the deadly collision for surveillance footage of the hit and run vehicle and suspects. They say they found what they were looking for. Some video footage of the driver and passenger stopping at a local gas station. They exit, try to go inside, however, it was closed. Authorities believe the vehicle is a 2007 to 2010 dark-colored Chevrolet Tahoe with tinted windows. The driver appears to be about 5'10", 200 to 250 pounds, wearing a tight-fitting head cloth, dark jacket, blue pants with a white pattern on the left leg. It was also wearing a white LA Dodgers t-shirt and white tennis shoes. The passenger appears to be about six feet tall, 250 to 300 pounds, wearing a white hoodie with an unknown dark logo and dark pants. The city of Los Angeles is now offering a $50,000 reward for critical information in this case. Reporting live in downtown Los Angeles, Chris Wolf, KTLA 5 News. All right, Wolfie, we thank you for that.